what if everything that you've ever bought and ever watched on TV and every website you've ever visited was reattached to your voter registration so that an unknown entity could figure out which voters would decide the Electoral College in 2016. 49% Trump, 48% Clinton. That's the vote, current vote count, 96%. How did they get the data? What did they do with it? Who did they share it with? And do we have a right to opt out of this? If we don't get answers to these questions, the future of democracy is not assured. At Cambridge Analytica, we are creating the future of political campaigning. Traditional political campaigns use geography and demographics like age and gender to break down voters into target groups. This can work up to a point, but it misses the important personal details that really drive voter behavior. We add a unique extra layer of data about personality, decision making, and motivation, so you know exactly who to target with exactly what type of message. We call this behavioral micro-targeting. They're trying to get to know you better than you know yourself. They are psychological profilers, and their aim to persuade you to vote for Donald Trump with political ads that match your personality. But the real question remains, will Americans realize that Silicon Valley's capture of our privacy rights threatens our democracy to its core? And will we realize that the FTC will not protect us? People don't want to admit that propaganda works, because to admit it means confronting our own susceptibilities, horrific lack of privacy, and hopeless dependency on tech platforms ruining our democracies on various attack surfaces. According to the law, you should be able to ask for your data to be deleted and for them to stop collecting it, and they refuse. You're allowed to ask, where did you get the data? How did you process it? And who did you share it with? They won't answer those questions. The fact that we've been politically modeled without our consent, our knowledge, or the ability to prevent it um, are all against the spirit of the law. I think we should sue Cambridge Analytica in London. We'll need to raise a substantial legal defense fund up front to defend the initial pl plaintiffs, including myself. Join the struggle to help get our data back. <laughs>